The distinguished gentlewoman, my friend, are from Washington, Ms. Del Benny. General Lady from Washington is recognized for two minutes. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Here we go again. Just 10 days ago, the House took a vote to attack women's health. At that time, I said it felt like deja vu. Now I'm starting to wonder if this is the only issue that my colleagues care about. Have we taken a vote to reauthorize the Export-Import Bank? No. Have we taken a vote to extend the Land and Water Conservation Fund? No. Have we taken a single vote this year to fix our broken immigration system? No. Yet somehow we found time to take vote after vote restricting women's access to care. It's reprehensible. The bill we're considering today is one of the worst yet. It's a dangerous and unprecedented assault on women and their health care providers. And it does nothing to address the real issues that Americans are facing. Mr. Speaker, voters didn't send us here to intimidate their doctors and interfere in their private medical decisions. It's time for Congress to stop wasting time and get to work. I urge my colleagues to oppose this rule and the underlying bill. Thank you, and I yield back. Gentlelady yields back her time. 